Change that beat up. Here we go.
Hi dear. Oh god. I'm not, I hope I'm not too loud. We have a <laughs> plain, plain webcam today because later I'm gonna have like my everything here but for now I'm just gonna keep it plain just so it's not the same thing as my let me move chat here so I can actually see it because I couldn't see anything otherwise but yes finally it's game night can't wait to play this game to be honest I've seen it so often and I've never played it and I'm so excited also yes we have a very sleepy Shiro that because it's too dark for you to see him unless I turn on the big light but it would completely fuck over the entire like lighting of the stream so I can't maybe later he'll he'll join us a bit closer so you can see him but for now he'll just chill in the background also I, I made myself some dinner it's the saddest dinner ever so I don't even want you to see it too much so at least I'm not gonna start today <laughs> And also, so at least I could start at a decent time because I always start way too late and then <laughs> everyone is like pieces out like an hour in. So I wanted to have a bit more timing, like a bit more time to also have a break in between because uh, the last two streams that I did while playing, I remembered that I ended up basically finishing at like midnight and midnight here is like for some people it's like 2 a.m other people it's like dinner time so i i was like okay i'll start a bit earlier because by usually towards the end of my stream so like at six it, there is more a bit more people and it's like a timeline that it's a bit easier for people to be able to join so might help as well just start a bit earlier and i'll have like a break in between so I can eat something and stuff like that which I should do because playing a game without a break in between melts my melt just melts my brain also I'm sorry if I'm like moving stuff around but I just created this like this overlay and I want to have like the what the time but at the same time, I don't know where to put it. So I'll, actually, I'll put it just right on top of me, like right above me. Because the fact is, I wanted to put it here, but <laughs> everything is so dark. And if I change a color, it's it's a mess. So I'll just keep it in, in here, just so we can keep up with the time and stuff like that. Mostly for myself, so I can have like a place where I can look at the time. Because if I look at my screen in the corner, it's too small for me. And I always have to strain my eyes. So, small thing. I'm, I'm gonna keep. Oh, I just noticed there is no music. I forgot. I forgot to put in the music. Sorry. Sorry. Just a second. I'm gonna have to change. Actually, let me. Let me see. Can I just like steal? Nope, I can't. Okay, I just noticed that I can actually finally open scenes and stuff like that. Great. Great timing. Okay. Let me do this. Sorry, I, I know I'm fixing, like... <laughs> I'm fixing stuff on stream, but I, I'm still, like... I'm not, I'm gonna be honest. I opened OBS at basically six thirty, and I still had to do my makeup and to like make myself dinner. So <laughs> I was just not not ready today. So I can add my little music thingy. At least now I have the music and you should be able to hear it. Can you hear it? You cannot hear it because I am what? An idiot. Yes. Now you can hear it. Yay. 
Unfortunately, I'm still like figuring out everything. Oh God, everything's such a mess here too, right now. Okay, I'll move it. Love how it's not letting me move shit. Yes, can have the music here. Yes. Now you can at least hear something outside of just me speaking. How are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. Actually, it's a pretty chill day. We, I, I kind of had, I had to clean because today the new owners, the people that are buying this apartment, came to visit because they had to take measurements for the kitchen. But at the end of the day, they decided like they're gonna keep the kitchen that we have. So we're just gonna like they're just gonna pay us for for that. But to be honest, it would have been expensive for us to have someone come in and take everything out. So I'm quite like happy about it. You're a very nice couple. The only thing that I'm very sorry about is the fact that I'm glad you're good. You're doing good. Oh, thank you. Oh god, now I understand. I, I couldn't understand why <laughs> it has it asked me for permission. <laughs> now I get it. Okay, let me just move this a bit up because I realized that I put the music over the chat. I'm just like not functioning properly today. I'll make like a cute overlay here as well, but I'll make it I'll I'll find a way. <laughs> but yeah, I'm doing pretty pretty cool, pretty good pretty good like it was very quite a relaxing day also like there's pretty like a storm coming in don't know when it's gonna get here but there's a storm coming in and the wind today has been crazy so because of the way this apartment is like structured and everything it's so easy to have just doors slamming and stuff like that and windows closing and or opening that I had to keep my door closed and this morning I had to lock it because otherwise um, because my door like the how can I call it basically the handle part there is a little metal thing that like you open so it retracts in and when you release it it closes that doesn't work that mechanism doesn't work so i i don't fully close it's like it's like having a door that just like you just push it and it stays there but you don't need to even use the end handle to open it it should be don't worry my old before i clean my my pc i had a keyboard <laughs> like i had a key that wasn't working so i had to like auto correct everything all the time i get it don't worry Oh god, okay. Sorry, that's something in my arm. So I had to lock it because it was the only way that my door would just like just the wind it wouldn't open and then slam close, which is quite stressful. <laughs> and I like waking up from like I was sleeping with doors slamming shut, it was too much for me. I was like I'll just lock it and I unlocked it when my brother came to told me to go have lunch because I was still in bed sleeping but like I knew that I would have been streaming so I was like if I sleep at least I'm awake enough to actually be able to stream because otherwise I would have been dead and I'm already kind of tired because I had to like clean and everything oh now finally in this lighting you can see my plants I love that for me I love that you can actually see them their glory also the two plants that i have outside i had to bring them in bring them in because because the because of the wind like i have two little like what i have like two cat cuttings of um, ivy that are just inside in a glass bottle and i just have them in there with water because they rooted and they're quite cute and then i have a smaller like juice little glass bottle with some cuttings of another plant in and I have to bring them inside because the bottles would tip, would like would tip over and like some of the cuttings would co would come out of the bottle and I had to like I have a little curtain that it's in between the two doors uh, just to avoid like bees and uh, too many like insects coming in and I close it 
like I keep that down for example at night to avoid having too many insects in which I enjoy and also if I open the doors people cannot see inside because there's at least even if thin like curtain there it's annoying I hate when I it's terrible. Like you wake up with waking up with like a loud noise. It's like just waking up with pure anxiety. It's like terrible. Okay, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, and I had to like nod it to the door that I have outside because I have like a security metal door. So like I don't only have this. I have another. Like I have something much more di more difficult for someone to come in. Which I'm cl quite glad, because if I leave this door open, it's still basically impossible for someone to come in without anyone in the building noticing. Because you basically just have to come in and cut metal. And they have- because it's a security door, you know, the keys are very complex and stuff like that, so I'm like, glad of that. I just noticed that I left my candles on. I'll have to go and blow them up, blow them up later, but like... It's so like, <laughs> it's like I'm quite lucky. For example, I don't remember when it was. It was last summer. I was with my brother, and what what were we doing? Like yeah, I was sleeping, and I heard like a loud ass noise. I was like, I was like, in, I was in bed, and I was like, absolutely not. I'm I'm first of all, I watched two. I haven't watched horror movies but you know how do you work so i'm not gonna go by myself and check i knocked on my brother's door and i was like i heard a noise can you please come and check because i don't know if there's someone trying to come in and stuff and i don't want to go by myself so i went with with like with him just so it would have at least we would have been two people and at the end it was just one of the um plugs just i think there was like some kind of spark or something and it smelled like burning so it was like great very secure once the people next to my old apartment got lost got lost their apartment thought was mine was theirs and they knocked at the door that's so you're like why is someone knocking at my door in the middle of the night but last time my my mom forgot to take the keys off uh, of the door because we'll leave them on so it's harder for someone to come in if you lock and you leave the door the keys on in it on the other side of the door so the fact that apartments you know they have those long keys are basically impossible to like open but you never know also that is the door is quite secure so it's a bit more difficult but you never know and my brother rang the doorbell I was like oh god what's going on who is ringing at this time some did something happen first of all I was like in panic because I was like did something happen to my brother second thing I was like no this this is coming from the corridor from like the inside of the building because there I noticed that the doorbell sounds a tiny bit different even though it's the same should be the same thing it sounds a bit different I was like okay I'll go <laughs> I, I'd like first thing I, I thought was like okay I'll check my phone and it was my brother but because I always mute my phone and I had it on my desk because I didn't even have to charge my phone I was like oh god I was lucky that at least I was awake because if I wasn't awake I would have I wouldn't have in it even heard it so <laughs> at the same time like Jesus fucking Christ I was like already thinking of the worst okay so Okay, I'll start opening the game and everything, so at least we... I start setting it, setting it up. In the meanwhile, you're not gonna see anything, because what I do, you can't see. I love that for myself. Unfortunately, like, the f beginning of the game is so, like, interesting, even just the opening, that I... <laughs> I want to show you the opening, but if I already have the game open, you you can't see it. And I was like, no. So I had to like close it and hopefully, hopefully, you're not going to have any kind of like, you're not going to miss, miss, miss anything. So, you know what? While I open the game...
Let me open the game. Just look at some puppies. <laughs> just stare in the background. Because unfortunately, to do capture window, you have to have it open. It's like a mess today. Okay. And let me switch. Once the game opens, because today we're having... I swear now you'll you'll get to see the game. I swear. I'm gonna change it. There you go. Let me just make this. Can you please get a bit smaller so at least everyone can see the entire screen? Yes, perfect. I would make myself also a tiny bit smaller so it's a bit easier. <laughs> yeah, I left. Oh god, why is it, why are there two chats? Oops. Whoops, I have two chats. Unfortunately. Where do you come from? Where is this chat coming from? Why are there two of you? This one is okay. I'll just I'll just delete one of them. <laughs> okay, now you can see it. Oh yes. Let me just move you in so I can actually start this game. Oh yes. Let me just also turn off the actual music because I still have the music in the background. <laughs> and it's annoying. Can you please? Oh, yes, here you are. Uh, I opened chat also on, <laughs> on my iPad so at least I could see. Okay. Okay, let me just move in a bit. Nick! <laughs> Hi! I haven't even seen you in so long. Okay, do I know how the commands of this game work? Absolutely not. I don't know what I'm doing, I'll be honest. Can I open it? Do you... What am I supposed to do? I'm clicking, but nothing is happening. Oh! Great makes sense to do. And I'm sorry about that. Can you hear? I'm going to start at the beginning with the house. Let me raise the volume of this game. Oh god. Fuck. Let me just Sorry, just a second. I'll raise the volume of the game a bit for you. Jesus fucking ring, oh Christ. Please let me leave. F4. Oh. I just had I just had to press F4. Sorry, I wanted to raise it so at least you can hear. Oh yes. This looks so cool. Do I know where I am? Absolutely not. I think it's him. I should be playing it with my controller. Where am I? What am I searching? Hi, crap! Let me open chat a bit bigger so I can actually see it. I see you remember me. Of course, I remember you. Like my teen years, I passed this. Oh, I have no. I have to use arrows. I knew that. Most of you don't know, but I'm terrible. I lived here until I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Thank you for the follow. I'm terrible at moving with arrows, so I am absolutely refusing to use my right hand to move. I'll use my left hand anyway. Oh, what is that? What are you? 
Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago, marked urgent, open immediately. I think I get it how it works. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Bleak. Okay, but the transition of the writing is cool as fuck. By the way, don't worry, like... Don't worry, like, oh, if you're lurking, it's fine. I'm looking barely at chat because I am no blind bitch, and we all know that. <laughs> In her will, my mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. A key? Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought that the mystery would be enough to bring me back. I would have been like, cool key, thanks mom. That's it. I hear frogs. Where are frogs? I hear them. They're very cute. I just noticed that I wouldn't have driven this way in a long time, but I saw a few hoof prints. I was gonna say this. I I I just un like heard that there is directional audio, so I have just frogs on my left in my left ear basically. Fine, I'm okay with that. Hi, hi sir. What the fuck was that? A horse? I got distracted. <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. The truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. To be honest, I kind of get it. Like, someone, basically, your entire family died and they all lived in the same place. And the last time you've been in that place is when your brother died. I think it's quite traumatic, and I think I would not But like... now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Makes sense. But also, like, I I don't think I would be able to go back to, the, to a house where something like that happened. <sighs> the house! Okay, I'm gonna sound quite weird. Before she starts speaking again and I interrupt her. I'm sorry, Edith. But, like, I have an extreme love for buildings in ruins. I love them. They're so cute. They're, like, so... I don't know. There's something so beautiful about it. About, like, earth coming in so, like, you can see plants start growing in it. I just... I, and also... The, the house the was game. exactly like I remembered it, the way I'd been dreaming about it. Okay, but that thing going over- okay, I'll use my, my other hand, I'll have to do it like this. That thing going up, it's so cool. This game- also this music is intense. I hope you can still hear me, I'm kind of screaming. There are two paths. Can I go here? Yes, I can. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. I'm sorry I'm eating, but I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> yeah, these stairs look safe. What is that? Just a broken chair? Oh god, I would live here. This is so fucking adorable. I asked Edie once about the dragon in the pond. She said it had killed her husband. I was six. It seemed like an odd joke to me even then. I'll be honest. 
kind of like it. kind of like it. Nothing missing. Oh, we have a cool necklace, though. Let me- I'm sorry, I have to charge my iPad before it fucking dies while I'm using it for chat. <laughs> my janky ass. Come on, please. Just- just stay there. Do not fall down. So, there was someone missing. I'm sorry if I hit the mic. I'm sorry. I just noticed that it was fully just head in the bike. Nothing more to interact with. Now, as a 17 year old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. Okay. I need to get into the mind of a 17 year old who lost her entire family and is completely terrified of this house. But let's interact, let's check the side. The plants are very well drawn. Also, yes, I'll explore every single corner. I am sorry. I like doing that. Like, I'm sorry, but look at this. This is so. I love it. I'm sorry. I have a love for like trees. Oh, this is with just the side of this. Okay. <gasps> there is a side of the house. Can I go in on cat? Hi! Let me let me just let me just I'll do it here. <laughs> Sorry. I am a Bit of a mess today. Can you do you let me okay? Does it work? Yes, it worked. I'm sorry, I'm <laughs> one day I'll start doing this a bit more quickly, but today I'm being a slow bitch. Okay, this is starting to get a bit too dark for my eyes. Fuck, I should have turned up the brightness of my... Mmm, Gary's Potter Mix. Wait, Macro Maxi? Do not know what that is. Why am I looking at the Potting Mix? Cat, just fucking leave. What I hope the it? key might unlock the front door. It didn't. Then I was right going to the side. Can you? Looking in, I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. If you don't know, I am absolutely terrified of looking or of peeking and afraid to see an eye staring back at me. But if you know why I'm terrified of that, you were also terrified as a, as a kid. Because of, I think, like, there was something that terrified me. I still don't know what. Oh, there's a chance. I was already about to die. Oh, there is. It's here. I just want to look through it. <gasps> there is a swing! This looks cute. Cat stop, just... By the way, I am absolutely terrified that something will come up and scare me. And if you don't know, I am terrified of everything. Nope, nothing, nothing here. Okay. Where are we going? It is. where are we going? Game, where do you want me to go? I heard something moving around in the garage. Are we going to try and get in the garage? Are we? Do I have it? Jesus fucking Christ. There is no dog though. So I can't really interact with her. 
I am so confused. What am I supposed to do? Hmm. Let me see. Uh, yeah, but I'm still terrified of anything because the thing is, even that noise kind of terrified me. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay, stand here, till I like figure something out. No, come on. Okay, we heard a noise, but where? Where should I go? Okay. So we can't open the door. So we're supposed to go somewhere then. I will try and go to the other side of the house. Maybe I can go there. Might as well try. So, we try to go through that side. I need to remember that we need to point on the other side of the screen. We tried going to there and we couldn't. We don't have a lock. We can go around it then, probably. Probably try and go to the side of the house. Froggies? There's so many frogs here. Where is a froggy? I just want a frog to jump out. I just want to see the frog. <laughs> Okay, maybe the other side, like if I go... Okay, what the fuck am I doing? I'm going through here. Where am I going? I can't see anything! Okay, there is a tree here. Okay, no, I can't- I cannot go through here, then. Okay. Where am I supposed to go, then? I'm not good at this kind of stuff, come on. Also, they didn't have the key. What the fuck? thinking of maybe I should watch a playthrough of this game like yesterday just so I don't look like a complete idiot but I was like eh, might as well just look like a complete idiot no one would be surprised if I didn't know where I was what I was doing I speak through the window oh no the reflection I hate the fact that there is no way for me of knowing where I'm supposed to go. Let's go back here. Two hours, my ass. This game is creepy as shit, though. I'll be honest. Wow, I have no. Perspective vision in here. Oh. Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Fucking slap me. <laughs> How could I not have figured it out? There is stuff here. Like, is that a trampoline? Boxes? Must be a, maybe a car they used to have. Not the door. Creaking. For the first time in years. I felt like I was home. Oh, that's so sad. And those are a lot of books. Not the creepy shit again. But instead of a family, there were just memories of one. Where's the 
this like absolutely the saddest thing ever. Like how only one restaurant would deliver to our house, so we had Chinese a lot. <laughs> Or how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon. Except our cat, Molly. What the actual fuck is this noise? The table was still a wreck from the night we left. Sorry, she is probably having a pretty intense dream. Because he's breathing heavy. <gasps> yes, yes. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just too much of it. Like a smile with too many teeth. Smile with too many teeth does sound worrying, but also look at this. This is just beautiful. I love, I love it. The books. Mom always told me to stay out of the basement, so I wasn't too surprised when the key didn't fit. Okay, because we're not going in the basement. Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara, along with the rest of the house. Jesus Christ, that's a lock. Oop. My mom wasn't much of an optimist, but she never stopped believing that my brother Milton was alive. After Milton disappeared, Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. Hmm. Okay, but all these pictures, too much for me. Hmm. What is here? Whenever people ask me about my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. But now he is Barbara then? Edie's father Odin built the original house. That must be Barbara's room. Fucking Christ, it's sealed. Okay. Let me look around a bit more. Hmm, there is another side here. I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Dude, but Uncle had a whale shark painted on his wall? My man. He's my man. If you don't know, I have a mini painting of a whale shark. I need to. Let me just open the door for Shido. Wait a second. Also, I hope the internet connection holds up because it's raining outside. But yeah, I have like a little painting on my wall. Maybe later if I take a break. Lewis I'll told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. So we'll be trying everything. <gasps> Turns out, 
My mom was really good at keeping secrets. <gasps> Oh, I have to move it up. Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Let's go in. <sighs> the fuck is this noise? Reading this, maybe it sounds like I had a plan, but I had no idea what was behind that door. <sighs> Like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. And with this, I'm gonna take out the bike. Molly. Hmm. I grew up looking at Molly's room through the peephole. Being inside for the first time, I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. I got the sense Edie had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. Okay, I realize my mouse pad is way too small to do anything in this game. <laughs> December 13th, 1947. Dear Diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's gonna happen. It started when mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving, so I looked around for something to eat. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Man, not the gerbil food. Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart! It's late. Go to sleep. The fuck is that accent? My Halloween candy was all gone. By the way, I'm very creeped out, creeped out by kids' voices. So, yeah. I'll just be creeped out for the rest of my days here. Oh, here it is. Not the window. I ate a lot of things that night. I kept paste. eating and eating. She ate the toothpaste. Bam, you okay? Then I heard chirping outside my window. It was a barn swallow going back to her nest. Oh, that's so cute. But also, why do you have anything poisonous in a kid's room? I reached out for her. And suddenly, I was a cat. She was a cat? Man, what's going on here? What's happening? Why am I a cat now? I don't mind it. Well, <laughs> I was terrified where it was going, but it's a cat, so I'm kind of okay. If I go back, can I? Oh, where am I going? I have to go there. Like where, where, where am I supposed to go? Like I can't go forward. <laughs> I 
I'm just stuck. Okay. <laughs> Not that eating the bird. I was scared they're gonna make her jump off, okay? I would have not been okay with that. But ma'am, where am I supposed to where am I supposed to go, please? Because I'm trying to jump, okay? This is jumping. We ain't doing much. We ain't doing much. <laughs> okay, let me close the door. There's some thunder going on outside. Can't see it, but she is all so dumb. She is so cute. Okay, where am I going? Like, I like being a cat. Like the concept, but. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Like, I feel stuck. Can't go anywhere. I literally can't go anywhere. How am I. Why am I. Mashing it. <laughs> I'm sorry for also I'm sorry for my loud ass keyboard. Let me move it a bit. Let me You working? Yes, you're working. Okay. So let's 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 plan this. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> Maybe there? Can I jump to there? Jesus fucking Christ, cat, use your eyes. I know they don't work well. I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared. Leave the bird alone. You psycho. Not the little bell, but it's a cat with the bell collar. Also, if this cat eats the bird, where the actual fuck is the bird now? Where, where, where are you? Got distracted. Don't know where the bird is. Oh, let's go forward. Oh, let's go forward. this can't go that side mom and dad didn't even look at me supposed to go now. <laughs> okay. I need to focus and understand where I'm supposed to go. Also, I need to speak because I've I've been quiet trying to understand where I'm going. So, I'm here. Is there somewhere I can jump? Like, the bird is up there. Like, it's not I can... It's not like I can jump there. so brain dead i don't even know where I'm okay i i got it that we have to get there we have to get to the top there wait you can see it like we can have to get there there's a cute very cute bird, bird it just looks so majestic i love birds I'm calling the police. Just for the trauma. Why can't I? Can you? Yo, asshole. Sorry. 
I'm just very distracted by the by the pretty meowing. Also, I'm sorry if I like move the vision quite weirdly, but my mouse pad is tiny as shit, and I can't really do much about it now that I think of it. I can't move enough. Okay, I lost the beard. Where's the beard? You find is that up there? Hey, we we going? We, where are we going? That's where it came from. So no. <laughs> Yo, this is the beginning. I'm getting stuck here. Do do you do? <laughs> I suppose like you okay fucked it I fucked it I fucked it okay maybe this way I need to go this way maybe this game hates me listen there I have to get there just oh god one day I'll get a better keyboard okay because this is ridiculous. Let's go to the edge. Okay, but look how pretty. Can we just look how pretty this is? Cat, stop. Foc focus. Cat me, but also this cat needs to focus. Where are we going? Can we jump up there? Did I want to do that? Maybe. Don't not know where I am, but... Yeah, exactly. It's probably... Oh, yeah. I think we're about to get towards the where the nest was, because it was... up this branch I'm not supposed to go up this branch I already lost where the there was the house where was the net was the nest up there I think Whoa! I have no sense of like what, what did I do <laughs> whoops I accidentally moved that okay so According to plans, I don't know where the nest is. So yeah, fine. The nest is there, I'm an idiot. The babies were all gone. <laughs> I'm ashamed of myself for not having found the nest before. I'll just take a sip of water because I'm ashamed of myself. Why did it close this so powerfully? Okay, I'll keep the water here. Is it in frame? Don't know. Then, okay. What are we doing now? Oh, we can go up here now? Sick. Whoa, I'm so confused with this per by this perspective. Where's the bird? That's the question. Where are you, bird? I already forgot where the nest is, so... My memory is just like absolutely shameful. Like shame. I feel shame of myself. Can I, can I get in? Mm -hmm. I'll just follow that bird wherever it wants me to go. I'm blind, blind. How <laughs> 
Let's... Where the fuck was the bird? Is the bird? I hear you, bird. But the directional audio is not helping at all. Uh... <laughs> oh, you're there. Hi, bird. Where you going, bitch? You flew. He flew that side, but it's not there. This bird, this bird is taking the piss out of me. See, the bird is laughing at me. I jumped and I almost got her. You're six. Calm down. If this cat is going to eat the bird, I am going to just close this game. We're just I'm just gonna open a random I don't know so solitaire game and I'll just play that. Because I am not about to kill a bird. I cannot see anything. I want to go there. What's that place? Over there. Oh, that's where the bird is. We can just jump down and then. Yay! Birdie. Yes, yes, yes. She was getting really tired. I was not supposed to do this. Oops. I was supposed to jump on the. What the fuck did I just do? <laughs> did someone just punch me in the face? Mm hmm. Why do you jump over the chair? I want to get on the chair. Hmm. Thank you, you bitch. This now bird. I was up in the big tree. I promised that I wouldn't climb it anymore. All I cared about was eating that mama bird. Don't eat the mama bird. An absolute asshole of a child. I shouldn't be that this angry about a child that is actually dead, but at the same time, fuck you. Okay, can we jump up there from here? Let's try. Yes, we can. Bird. <laughs> I'm tired of following this bird around. <laughs> Can you tell? <laughs> I'm getting less like entertaining. I mean, I'm not even that much of an entertaining person, but like I'm speaking less and less because I'm just mad at this bird. Okay, I can't go there. Where's the bird? Probably we have to climb up, most likely. Because if they're telling us that we shouldn't be here. Let me just climb vertically like a cat. Come on. I think you're almost there. Probably. I'm probably almost there. But okay. Let me think. Where should I go next? I can't see where the other branches are. So I'll probably go down here. So I have a bit of a better perspective. They could have made the bird a bit more visible, but I am also a blind ass bitch. <laughs> Can I stop losing this bird? 
the thing is, I think I should be able to catch it like right now. But I am being too much of a like too slow. Because the bird is like I don't see it, so it's probably I have to probably catch it somewhere there. I gobbled her up. <laughs> and suddenly I was an owl. First, what? all I heard was the wind. And then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. It's just me. It's me as a rat. There's a person on a cliff? Where is the person on a cliff? I oh, fuck I didn't see I didn't see it. of like And into the ocean. Oh, the Can now, you imagine? I was hungrier than ever. Oh, let's go where the things are. There's as much swimming as much swimming as you're ever gonna see me do. In game, just in general. Sorry, I'm like...
with the snake now. Perspective like this now. Oh, I'm a bit. I'm an idiot. Now I was a monster, and I smelled people everywhere. That is creepy now. Me why I don't want to have kids. This game is terrifying <laughs> when it comes to the idea of having a kid that just. I was big, but I moved real quiet. Yes! Ah! This is scary as shit. I don't know the words either. The fact that I know it would happen but it, I still jump, it makes you think understand how terrif like how terrified of everything I, I can be.
kind of perspective here. Just the middle. How can I get there? Not from here, basically. Tap. You're an idiot. Probably going out. And then. Like going. Yeah, out here. They don't think it was going here. We are eating people. See us? No one is noticing people being killed. Love that for us. I slithered onto the sand, and the good smell went into an old pipe. Okay. Why am I having so many issues with controlling this fucking thing? See, I, I can't use arrows. Oh, okay. Basically, the arrows of my keyboard are kind of shitty, so I don't like using them because I have to click a ton for them to work, and I'm so used to using AWSD. I kind of don't know. Oops. Am I back? Where am I back where I was exactly a second ago? Am I in the same place? I think I am. Oh no. I got closer and closer. Fuck, that's our bedroom. Isn't this the bedroom of the child? All of my stomach started growling. And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time, but I couldn't hear anything. I think it's waiting for me to fall asleep. But it's not going to wait much longer. It needs to be, and we both know I will be delicious. Is this kid okay? <laughs> what the? Sorry, but uh, this was quite confusing. I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have. <laughs> For fuck's sake! <laughs> oh, so this is like the map that we we're supposed to. What we we're supposed to like see. Okay. It's saving. Good job, cat. This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. 
Edie would have, but Mom didn't like bringing up the past. Though, when we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. Aww. Her room was like a museum. For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune oh, and really misfortune. Sorry. Wait, Odin Finch okay. buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn son, Johan. Oh, so it's... On January family. 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family and his house, hoping to leave the curse behind. But 40-foot waves off the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Poor family. Like, Jesus Christ, that's... look. <laughs> Odin's daughter, Edie, with husband Sven and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Orcas Island. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Yeah, so something. Family cemeteries are creepy as fuck. Like, if I die, do not bury me behind the house. Of course I'm gonna come back and haunt your ass. Come on. At least, I don't know. Scatter my ashes somewhere, and maybe I need a little bit more time to get to you and haunt you. And haunt. Uh, I think it's Scandinavian lands. Yeah. Yeah, I've been. I finished it. Can I like? Where's this? <laughs> this doesn't let me. Okay. We've done this. We've seen this. Yes. The way I'm using my. <laughs> oh, I had to go back. Wow, I'm an idiot. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. Oh, it's a family tree. But I just noticed it's a family tree. Honestly, cat. Jesus Christ, you can't do shit. Is there anything else we need to see? Also, the way this room is structured, it's cute. I don't make the rules. Oh no, it's sealed. We might still like going. Lewis what? died a week before we left, but Edie had already started to memorialize him. Lewis, I already forgot who Lewis Edie gave is. a big interview about a mole man living under the Finch house. My mom was furious. Sorry, I need to put on some eye drops. My eyes are already starting to look blue. Okay. Sorry, I was starting to not see shit. I hadn't thought of myself as Edith Jr. for a long, long time. Oh, she's Edith Jr. again. Mm. When Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon, she could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. <laughs> she could have, but she didn't. Aww. Even in her 90s, sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. That's actually very cute. That's our granny. The fuck is this bedroom? Bathroom. Ew. Why is it fur? The only trace Grandpa Sam's first wife Kay left on the house was the pink bathroom. Yeah. It was a pretty big trace. Yeah, it's fucking ugly. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm not gonna lie about it. Oh, the little chair in the bathtub. Because when you get old. Nope, still this way too. Oh. There. There's a secret in this bathroom. 
This is cute. Hey. Bitch. Hey. There's a secret in this bathroom. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in the cupboard. Hey. Yeah, let me go back there. Ma'am. It's hidden in this book. This is cool though. Ma'am. Where are we going? Oh, they are developing pictures. That's cool. Sven gave Sam an old camera he'd refurbished. He never put it down. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. What's up? Just drinking. Oh. This is creepy as fuck, though. I'm sorry. Wait, can you imagine you have a passage and it's right at your feet? Everything is closed off. I knew Grandpa Sam had a twin. And that he never talked about him. Oh no. I guess my grandpa didn't like history any more than my mom did. to remember my brother by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, that was it. I remember this from the promo. My brother said he'd die before he ate another mushroom. And he did. No, Jesus Christ. Yay, let's go fast. I've had a swing, so you know to At Barbara's funeral, we swore he'd never be afraid again. And he wasn't. A cliff on the left? Fuck, it's true. It looks like someone is on the cliff. I didn't even notice. I thought it was like a tree or something. I think Calvin Maybe always wanted to fly. Sam! Calvin! Dinner's ready! Coming! But that day, he finally made up his mind to do it. Why am I this excited about this? Also, my brain just is not really happy about all this movement with my eyes, so... I told him going around was impossible. Maybe if, if I hadn't has said that. Like I don't know if I hadn't said that. Oh no. There's a fall on his head. Please don't know. I'm not gonna tell you again. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up. Oh no, he died because he fell and on maybe the Maybe he'd still be here. But I doubt it. Do you want me to fly? I think he'd already made up his mind. Also, I, I tried so many times. That's what I want to remember about my brother. Also, he already has a broken foot. Why is he on a swing? I shouldn't even go on swing. My brain is doing funny things with all this imagery. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> it's not good. <sighs> the 
day he made up his mind to fly. And he did. Calvin's story felt strangely familiar. When I was younger, I remember trying to do the exact same thing. So this game is trying to break my heart. Oh my god. Hey, bitch, please. Close the book. You got some issues, but like... At the funeral, Edie roped off Calvin's half of the room. Edie, 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 I'll have to check again who Edie Mom is. said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. Mm. Roped up so if Grandma, Grandpa was the twin. Then yeah, probably. No, no, I don't want to go back. No, no, don't let me go back. I want to check what else is here. Yes, up here, probably. <coughs> Fucking Christ, cat. Okay, nothing here. I still try to get through the door, but like... So they really wanted me to cry then, I think. Okay, I think the only thing li Oh no. <laughs> Cat, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> I, I was pretty sure that it's like, it's not possible that they haven't done anything. I'm sorry, but I love whatever is going on in this house. Oh, I have to pull it then. Oh no, I have to push it up. The passages were a pretty tight fit. Mm, They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Also, why are you letting your kids have, kids have like secret passages? Growing up, I always thought of Barbara as a child star. I never thought about how hard it must have been for her afterwards. Yeah, most child stars just are get completely fucked in the head. Like completely. Because it's like so such a stressful thing. Of all the stories people wrote about Barbara's death. I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Oh god. Old Jack here with another- Old Jack here with another ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it the surprise ending of Barbara Finch. No. Your funny party. As a child star, Barbara was famous for her scream. Now at 16, she was all washed up. A has been. But in a lucky break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at the local convention for monster movie fans. It was just a boost her career needed. Unfortunately. Her scream hadn't aged well. <gasps> mm, getting better. I think you just need the right motivation. Her biggest fan, and current boyfriend, Rick, was about to demonstrate when... <laughs> now that was a great scream. Ew. It was Barbara's father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Her convention comeback was cancelled. Okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I try... 
A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orca's Island tonight. Police are urging residents to... That came from the basement. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your basement door locked? Because my dad likes making puzzles in secret passages. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret is to keep to winding back. and winding until finally the key pops out. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in a sec. 20 minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. So Barbara went to look for him right on cue. I'm already like freaked out. She reached for the music box. Okay, so it's our time then. And as she wound the key, she listened for Rick, but the house was silent. I don't think I'm ready to go in a basement. Jesus, not this music. Christ. She found Rick's crutch and imagined the worst. Not this bloody hand crank. Oh god. The gang's leader is the infamous hookman killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. Jesus Christ. <laughs> she was, she was, oh god, wait for a second. She was just coughing behind me. I'm terrified. Okay, we have friends. If there is a jump scare, I will punch someone in the face. We're going back here, right? I'm sorry, I have to take my headphones on because it's off because it's this music is too. Fucking Christ is a boyfriend. Rick? <laughs> okay, just. Barb, relax. I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not scared, Rick. I'm furious. Then act furious. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and. She threw him out, but she kept a little something to remember him by. Barb! Have you seen my other crutch? And she was still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. Hours later... Barbara! Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Okay. Not the I'm kid. Coming up, but if this is a trick, you're dead, Walter. Where are the stairs? I have to go here. I hate every second of this. I already forgot how this house is. Jesus Christ, I have to go upstairs. No. You may not go there. I feel such bad anxiety. I'll have to go this way. Let's go. Let's 
good, I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> Hope that can clear okay. Walter, are you there? Walter has vanished. But his bedside radio is still on. Orcas Island police describe the man as six feet tall with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. I returned. Saw the hook man and was speechless. He was quite smashing. He couldn't get enough of Barbara. Okay, Barbara, there's got to be another way out of here. I can't see shit, I can't see shit. We have to go back then. This is, uh, I'm sorry, but I need to... <laughs> yeah, the, the comic book thing is so cool. I'll be extra. But I am still, like, absolutely terrified of this. Why am I putting back my headphones on? The only reason I'm doing it is just so I can listen to the voiceover and I don't have to, like... Listened for his breathing, but all she heard was. I am so scared. Door, dying to speak to young Barbara. At the door, she heard a whisper. Was coming from inside the house. Fuck. Fuck. <gasps> oh dear. <laughs> you don't dare go on. Bravo, You were wonderful. The monsters had come to surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream. And she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. She was going to be famous. And with her final breath, Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. Sir? I wasn't there myself, but I hear Barbara She had a taste for stardom, but unfortunately, so did her fans. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick, who disappeared the same night. And little Walter, hiding under his bed the whole time. He took it all pretty hard, but that's another story. As for Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Her ear. Ew. Now that's what I call a real 
hear a tale. That joke. Not the ear in back, you. Okay. Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Okay, so we are at the end there. Okay, let me just We're Edith, Louis and Milton. Her underweight loss, but she must be like if I'm not wrong, she must be our grand like great grandma. Maybe. Also, um let's <sighs> let's take a second to breathe. And this is why I don't play horror games, because you can see how it was just in pure anxiety and it wasn't even anything to be scared of <sighs> wait no 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 I'm not supposed to go go out no cat cat what the fuck are you doing I have to find the other passage okay let's look for it Be. Also, the sound of the wind, the audio like design of the. Am I interacting too much? Oh, don't worry. Actually, I like. I like the interaction. It brings me out of the game sometimes because I am someone that gets way too into things, and I get kind of stressed. So I'd rather have like an extra second of like re-centering myself it's funny all those times i played with the music box and never found the basement key they probably sealed it man so are we go do i have to go back I'm just I'm sorry I'm walking around like a maniac but I you never know yeah, I'll, I'll probably go back probably I have to go back right I guess now I know why mom didn't like me playing with the music box oh okay <laughs> me not realizing how to do things is still like the funniest thing ever So we're back here. Okay. Not the basement. I really don't want to go, but probably it's not going to be as anxiety inducing as them. A lot of things got left behind in the whirlwind what of cat last that? night. Not the creaking. I really do not want to do this, but I have to. Remind me to keep myself sane. Okay. Let me just... Let's go in. Let's go in. Nothing's gonna happen. Cat, it's all gonna be okay. Oh. It's so much less scary. Honestly? Looks quite cute. 
Mom said the basement was off limits, unless I wanted another tetanus shot. <sighs> tetanus shots are painful as fuck. I am lucky because I never had to get one, but I've been told that they are soon. I saw Edie sneak down to the basement once, carrying packages. Oh, I sorry, I can't see anything, I'll be honest. Okay. Oh. I thought maybe she was hiding presents. It's, it's door. <laughs> okay, I'm blind. It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. I remember asking mom once about where Walter had gone. Sir, this is a Wendy's. So we're in the dark. I'm just walking in. She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as he could. If there's a pattern in all these stories, I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. So he hit down here. Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. Daddy? On that first day, after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive a week. But after a few days, I settled into a routine. That's what kept me sane. Having a schedule, living for today. I always expect it to be dead tomorrow. But if you wait long enough, you'll be used to anything. Music is fun, really. Even a monster on the other side of the door starts to feel normal. And maybe I got a test in this shot. Almost friendly. This guy just ate like peaches. And then one day, so everything just stopped. Whatever that thing was, it was gone. Maybe it got tired of waiting. Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. So this dude just lived 30 years in the basement? It's been a week now, the longest in 30 years. I'm done waiting. I have to leave. Well, I still can. Let go, dude. Let's go. Where the fuck? Okay, no. I don't have to go this way. Oh! There's a spot here. I am never go- You'll never catch me going in a place like this. Terrifying. Also, how many books? How many books? Let go. Okay. I know it's out there somewhere. What's out there though? Whatever Sorry. killed Barbara. Killed Barbara. Oh. And Molly. And Calvin. I don't know. Maybe this is all a mistake. But I need to stop living the same day, even if it kills me. Whatever's out there, I want you to know I'm ready for it. 
I'm going to appreciate all of it, especially the food. I don't mind if I only have a year left. Or a month. Or a single week. I'd be happy with one new day. I can already imagine the sun on my face. Don't get a hit by a train. Don't tell me we have to go there. Walter died when I was six. I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. Okay. So the three kids were killed by the same person or thing, the train. <laughs> it, it seems like they were all killed by different thing, different reasons, but the fact that they died like, he, he feels like it's like someone- I'm sure my mom was trying to protect me. If- if Edith Jr. So, if we die, I'll kill someone. I'll punch someone. In the actual face. I really don't want to do this. Like, I'm scared we are gonna get hit. Maybe she was afraid I'd end up like Walter. To be honest, but quiet. if she never told me about an uncle under the house, I can only imagine what else she was hiding. I don't want to make the same mistakes she made, trying to bury something that's still alive. Hmm. <gasps> now that there's only one of us left, or maybe two I thought it was time I heard the stories for myself this and found out what happened to everyone breaking. else but now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem maybe we believed so much in a family curse we made it real it is actually kind of It is a thing when you start believing something, you kind of bring it into reality. And I don't want to say. You think you're going to finish the game today? Yeah, it's about three out, like two and a half to three hours long. So I think I'm gonna finish it. Absolutely, but I do not know. So where are we going? So I think generational trauma in this has a big thing, like, plays something into it. So, where am I supposed to go now? For now, I'll, let's just like, admire the view. Because this game is not that new. I'll just tell, I'll tell you. We'll look it up later, but it's technically not that new. But the visuals of this game are so fucking pretty, and counting that I'm playing it connected to my PC, we all know that this PC is not- my PC is not that great. Oh, this where the track fell. Can we get there? No, we are not the cat. I can't- I can't jump there. Oh, there's a path there. <laughs> Idiot. I'm an idiot. I don't know if I should even be writing this. I think it's probably like. Maybe it'd be said. better if all this just died with me. No. We got sensor lights. But I thought you should know about your family. So we are writing to someone. Okay. And the history you're a part of. Okay, I thought we were just like, bye, I'm going in the water.
Should I be going this way? I don't know. I'll go anyway. Yep, can't go up there. This game is so sad, but also so good. You think he'll die while visiting the house because you are fighting? Yeah, no, no, I'm sure that I'm not. To be honest, way, but... I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Oh, okay then. I have to go here then. I think the people in these stories believed them, for what that's worth. It does make sense though. Alright, we're back at two. Yeah, we're back to the house. I think. Let's go up then. I'm gonna be honest, I can't see much, so I'm trying I'm trying to guess my best to like do anything. I know that nothing is going to happen, like you can't die basically in this game. It's not like you can, can do look much. At the house. That history of imagination and stubbornness and madness. Any of it seems possible. Like, I know that you can't die, but the fact is that I am just anxious in general about anything happening, so... <laughs> am I going to, I, Am I supposed to go that way now? Nah. Oh, go that way. Oh, there's a path there. Let's go here. I think we've been surrounded by death for so long, we've just gotten used to it. Oh, fuck. I know there what is... kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? I feel like this game, it, I feel like we're not far from the end, even though there are still a lot of people that we need to know the story of. I feel like we are not gonna need to know the story of them, like their story, the story of the entire family, but I think we are almost at the end anyway. At least it feels like it, I'm not it's sure. It's embarrassing for me to admit this, but the pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. Sir. Three Sir. of the gerbils were mine, and two had been my fault. Not all gerbils. They were all frogs! I heard frogs, that's why. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Alright, bro. Walter. Edie. Sven. Calvin. Whoa, I'm not good. Molly. Start cooking for. <laughs> oh, don't worry, don't worry. Like you can just like be here for a bit. Don't worry about it. Where did I just go? Why am I here? This way, no, I can't. I have to go down and go. <laughs> Today, my ability. I'm sure to... Odin's monument had been Edie's idea. My <laughs> mom was always trying to move on, but for Edie, the past never went away. You were right, Nick. You were right. There, there is, there is. It's a man. Oh, so there's also a woman with a guitar. She could see it. Poking out of the water at low tide. Mm. Let's use this. Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Oh, it's the old house.
Okay, where are we supposed to go then? Not here. <laughs> This is. I'm sorry. Let me just not get distracted. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. <laughs> this game has just started rotating me so I don't lose too much time. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. Sam, Gregory, and Gus. So those are our, her uncles then. Okay, the cemetery is like left though, because the the way it's structured is so like, I don't know, it's so cool. She lost two of her brothers, just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Louis. There's so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For me to come back someday. And find everything out for myself. Can I go up here? Oh yes I can! Let's go! Tree house, tree house, tree house, I'm sorry. Tree house, tree house, tree house. I like tree houses. <laughs> Is this where we were with the... But looking back on it now... Bird and the cat, yeah. If she told me there was going to be so much climbing... <laughs> Sorry, I can see where I'm supposed to go right now. I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. Twenty-two weeks pregnant. Can we please not die with our unborn child? With our fetus? <laughs> okay, where where the actual fuck are you going? We decide. There are stairs here, come on. Why can't I go up here? Side then. Why is it so dark? I was I should turn off the my spotlight, but like my light that I use, but you wouldn't see anything anyway. So so now I'm under it, which is not where I'm supposed to be, I imagine. <laughs> I think we have to climb and get in here. But why why can I not get there? Like there are stairs here. Not sta not real stairs, but like enough of a stair. Maybe tripping? I never met Grandpa Sam, but I think he and my mom Sorry. had a lot in common. Sorry, I just just had to collect a different thing, and it would have worked. <laughs> I accidentally double click. I'm sorry. They were both pretty intense. Not the bear. <laughs> We'll lower the music. Okay, no, the guitar kicked in, it's nicer. But everyone left the letter. Oh. <laughs> 
freaking salty. Dawn, I promise you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Dawn. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Shouldn't we be leaving? Just want to get a shot of you, Don. Then we can take off. I'm over here, Dad. Just need to get a shot of you, Don. Then we can hit the road. It's gonna rain the whole weekend, isn't it? I will never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. That camera's older than you are. Right, Dad, it's starting to clear up. Still freezing, though. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'll be honest, but... Definitely should not have drunk all that coffee. We want to take a picture of our dad, don't we? And if you don't, you're wrong. I hate the fact that I don't know what I'm, what I'm supposed to take a picture of, but... Nothing quite like being outside. Oh, yes. Hmm. Hold still! Hey! <laughs> I knew That's it. That's a keeper. I knew we were supposed to take a picture. A little more gas in the tank, I guess. I'm just saying, I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff, if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? To tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. Last time I was with my brother Calvin. Man, that was a great trip. Your grandpa's fan taught us how to fish, how to build a fire. I really don't know what this We found an old go. logging trail. There were deer everywhere. I bet if I could remember where that trail was, we'd spot a buck for you in no time. Good eyes, Don. Oh, that's so cute. Before you take the shot, let me get like... a picture of you. Great shot, Don! No. <laughs> I'm proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? Oh, so sad. <laughs> so we were crying. Sorry, Don. Just gotta reset the timer. But I 
really don't know what I'm supposed to do now, I'll be honest. Hang on, kiddo. Just trying to get a shot of the two of us together. <laughs> the two of us together... Okay. So, we're waiting. Then we have to run up. <laughs> Dad, it, it's twitching. I think That's it's totally so normal, Don.
sorry, I'm having too much fun. But I know what happened wasn't your fault. That's cute. Good luck, Kay. Love, Sam. Okay. Does it let me do F4 this bitch? Okay, I'm sorry. I need to lower the volume a bit. I'm pressing F4. No, it doesn't work anymore. It worked a second ago. Sorry, I'm trying to lower the volume because it's a bit too bitch f4 worked a second ago why it's not working now okay shit okay now it works i'll lower it just a tiny bit i'm sorry if it's too low simply because it was a bit like i had to scream because otherwise it, I would have been covered by the music. At least I think. If you can hear me properly, just tell me. Because I'm not sure. Oh god. Four people. Yep. Why four, five, maybe five people. And then... And then we had enough trauma for today. Don't you think? Don't you think? I can't imagine my mom ever writing poetry and yet... A poem for Gus. Who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Oh. Oh. It's loading. Okay. We Our father it. never hit us kids, at least not very hard. Before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. Okay, it's not readable. Or... It's backwards. Bitch. Uh, oh, I was pressing the wrong thing. Cat pressing the wrong things, of course. I'm pressing the wrong fucking thing. My father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. Hey, hey, hey. Fuck. Whoa, I'm bad at this. I tried to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her, we don't need a stepmom, were the words that I, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Uh. Yep. Cat's not being happy about a new marriage of your worst. Nothing crazy new. Whoop. I'll be honest, it's very hard to control. It's a piece of shit. When the time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But Gus declined, and as a sign held up his middle finger. Well, that's a way. The wind picked up, and panicked geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. Don't tell me he died during the wedding. Jesus Christ. The rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. Oh no. Do we need that much trauma? I don't think we need this mentally, but it's cool. Thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But 
Well, my father said this. Make the music louder. Not the chair. Okay, the fact that we. Okay, this is pretty though. I'm sorry, I need to stop. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Nope, the tent killed the kid. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day. Oh, they're on the beach. It's alone. so pretty to see those. Just hear the wind, the sea, and foam. But I didn't until it's we like found you. you. Oh no. She never talked about him, but mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. Okay. Okay. Little mental checkup because this game is pretty heavy. How are you doing? You're all good? Remember to breathe. Remember to drink some water, which I'm going. Actually, I'm not going to do because otherwise, I'm going to run to the bathroom and I already drank half my bottle in the stream so i'm gonna need to pee pretty soon <laughs> otherwise but i wanna i'm just too into it to pause so everyone is good take care of yourself if you're watching this while eating have a nice dinner or lunch or meal sorry but what the stripper pole doing you know it's a normal pole but my brain brain just went that's a stripper pole why can i not find it anymore Wait, was it visible on was like this one? I want to climb it, but I also want to climb basically anything. So I must stop. I must. Now I'm gonna stop here. Okay, fishies. Oh, we can climb up. My mom moved up to the loft after her brothers died. So she had to. At the time, <gasps> it was as far away as she could get. Okay. No. Wait a second. This is the cool part you could see on the outside of all the little thingies that you had to climb. Sorry, I'm having a bit too much fun. That's a cool bedroom for a teen. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Uh, sorry, sorry. My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Louis was born a year later. Louis is our big brother, I think. I think it, that is what it's supposed to be. Who he is supposed to be. Oh, stairs. When my dad died, I don't think mom knew where else to go. But to come back home, right? I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. Oh, oh no. Not the dead plans. Not coming to drop. Get and to see kids in the house again. Oh. <laughs> Cooking. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry about it. Be safe, cook, look at what you're doing. I'm just like vibing here. The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. I'm sorry, but at the beginning, if you saw, there was like the little pillar with like all the like add ons on the house, and I think that's this part which i kind of love i'm not gonna lie is it probably and for a safe? while things were good almost it, normal was it safe absolutely not but it didn't last mm. of course it didn't <laughs> the beginning of the end was milton's 10th birthday no, when Edie gave him birthday. castle castle first of all do you think a 10 year old is safe here i'm sorry I should not be this this mean. I uh, mean, I know that, but my brain just went straight to you should not have built built something like this. But no. okay, saving, saving. Yes, we're in here. Okay, but like, if you're young, a thing like this would be so cool. Oh, we are climbing! <gasps> this is so cool! I 
I know that people are is uh, is that like there are dead people here, but it's game, so I can still like think it's cool, right? Right? Not another one. Oh. Milton Finch in the Magic Paintbrush. Oh. Hey, bitch. School. Oh, cute. Oh, it's cute. Oh, you're looking at it. disappeared that was the logic of the door closing and just disappearing okay whoa 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 see this floor this would be my personal hell though because uh i ain't good at like heights more than heights i'm not good at like i don't know Things like being able to Mom see through them. searching for my brother, oh. and she sealed the doors. Of course, she sealed the doors. Like poor woman, I'm. I feel so sorry for her mother. Oh, that's that's just paint. That's paint. That's paint. Okay, that's paint. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. Okay, where are we going next? Uh, let's breathe. The view is so beautiful. I need to stop, like... I need to stop fangirling over this game, but this game is so beautiful, I... I'm sorry. Oh, we can go over here, though. Let's go up, can we? Can you let me go up? Thank you. Thank you. Mom yeah. definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. Oh no. Well, this does not seem safe. Oh, but this is so cool. We, I think we have to get to the top, but so we, we, we're not doing that, okay? After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Until mom got him a job at the cannery. Okay, do we have to go here? I right, go, okay. Shooter's outside, so if you hear barking, I'm sorry, but I think I'm loud enough for, to cover it right now. Let's get in. Hey. Oh, okay. I didn't know where I had to make you get in. Let's go. <gasps> this is so pretty. Oops, sorry. Lewis's room smelled very, very familiar. Oh. That part of him lived on. It smelled like a teen. Oh, we don't know. I should age. Lewis and I spent a lot of time playing games together, but he was surprisingly bad at them. He died a lot. Oh, God. It's like a mix to a PS1 and. A, oh god, I don't remember the old one. And a Sega. I feel like. Don Finch. Uh. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began oh in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Oh no. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. He kept working at the cannery. But he withdrew part of himself. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. His mind began to... Mm. 
wander. Well, it must be boring. Oh no, I wanted to grab the other thing, but okay. Oh yes, uh, no, we are going up there. Okay, no. I need to be faster, I'm sorry. I, I no. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get here and go up, right? Why doesn't it let me do what I was doing beforehand? Okay. I I don't know. I'm trying to understand what I'm how I'm supposed to reach there. Because I do not want to take the fish, but also like it's impossible for me to be fast enough to not take the fish. So I'm trying to understand what the fuck is going on. Jesus fucking Christ. I, I have to get up there, but I don't know how to. I, get I asked him to describe it. He said he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. He'd feel his way about. Now I understood what the fuck was going on. Oh god, I'm so dumb. I'm sorry. Then something moved. Bats. Oh, not the and bats. Toads. And things that have not names. So we're back to the monsters. And he knew it was all in his head. Oh god. He took it very seriously. Dude, I, I don't have good agility. Mm, oh god, this is hard. I have to do two but different he found methods. something more. This castle. I worried about him then. Daydreaming at the cannery. Yep. I don't know where I'm going. I'm sorry. I got it completely wrong. I spoke with his boss. But he said Lewis had become a model employee. Yeah, of Methodical, course, if your brain tireless, focus. If your brain is basically somewhere else, you're gonna be a lot more a lot faster, I'll be honest. It's true. Like a whole new Lewis. Uh, like even when I'm like doing certain tasks so that I are like very repetitive. On. It's so risky to have your brain somewhere else, but also it's you work a lot faster probably. I even encouraged him. Oh god. Sorry, I'm starting to lose the ability to move. It seemed very promising at first. He told me he'd made a new friend. Oh, doggy. Sorry. Doggy. Cute though. On the edge of a city he named Lewis Topia. 
Yo, come down with the fishes. Come down with the fish. Sorry, I'm actually not good at this kind of shit. Okay. Also, the fact that it's an angle and not from the top. Up slowly, brick by brick. Oh, that's a way to do it. Yes, to the drones. Yay. Then he made musicians. I'm vibing though. Oh, sorry, got stuck. And songs for them to play. He talked about starting a band. And he was always humming. Sorry, the music is catching. His imagination grew strong. He no longer spoke at the piano. Well, I can't imagine that if you have this going on in your brain, I wouldn't speak either. That's fun. Tell me how many people are there who needs to speak. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. Yay. Then one day it struck him. That all the cheering crowd. Even the stones under his feet were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. He held an election for mayor. And he won. <laughs> That's cool. Sorry, they I'm... begged him to stay, but his mind was already wandering. Okay, sorry. I need to go on the boat. Oh god, this was it hard. Having a game to... for him. Having to move uh, with the arrows and then re repeating the movement, it's like very difficult. He'd conquer a city, then immediately push on. Okay. I'm getting better though. Lewis. Hey. You getting better? Kinda. St. Louis. St. Louis. That's an actual city though. I don't he know. He started about drifting it. away from our reality. Whoops. Eat. I hit something. Yeah, we love this association here and this household. We live with the situation. Minneapolis. So, oh. Until okay, one so day he gone. forgot to go home from the cannery. Oh, he forgot to go Even home. as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Oh god, he lost his mind completely, basically. Oh, this is actually... Jesus Christ. Do you want me to actually fucking die then? So you want me to be sad. Just completely sad. In Lewisburg, he heard rumors of a... I'm sorry, I stopped a bit because I'm trying to... I see that it's like... A bit overwhelming for my PC. Oh, let's go with Beautiful Prince. Let's make it gay. Beautiful Prince. Yes. Yes. I'm sorry, I had the option to make it gay, I'm sorry. Also, this boat is slow as shit. The oh. prince was on his own quest for... Radius rainbows. Why not? Radiant rainbows. Thank you for making this game. I love you. I'm making this is making it so much gayer, but so much better. Okay. 
I'm sorry if I'm pausing just a second because I know I noticed that like just let me go. Jesus Christ. Can you Oh god, I hate it. Yay, yay, okay. I just saw that it's a bit glitchy, so let me just a second close something. Okay, I'm sorry if I'm closing a bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm just like avoiding my CPU getting too overwhelmed. Sorry about it. Okay. Closing everything. Okay. This should be a bit better. I hope it's a bit better. Let me just look for a second. It's still a bit twitchy. It's still a bit glitchy. I hope you can still see a bit. And in case, just tell me in chat if something's going wrong. Okay. Okay. Oh. oh. Okay, it seems to work better now. I just close, I crow. Sorry. Oh, we need to go back into the swing of things here. Oh no. He followed the sound of his. Ah, silver harp. Let's make it absolutely the most romantic gay thing ever. Silver harp. I, I know that I can be a bit faster by- oh no, 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 play, sorry, sorry, sorry. I can make it a bit faster, but also I am very inept at this shit. His chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun and west of the moon. Also, kind of feels like a D&D campaign. I'll be honest. Even then, his logic remained sound. Oh fucking Christ. Okay, we got no more screen left. Fuck. He's a seal! He knew the world was all in his imagination. Wait, dude, dude, there's too much fish here. What's going on? Okay, this is starting to get a bit too so proud of having created it. Oh god, this In is too much. In his own eyes, he becomes something greater than a king. Oh god, this is struggle. I think uh, two or three people are like two people. For I, I'm never known success in the real world. I think it was overwhelming. This is a bit too much. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm a bit too focused the on real this. Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. Oh fuck. Shit, shit, fuck, fuck. Oh no, we have to go upstairs. Cat, focus, 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 focus. This is hard. My imagination okay. is as real as my body, he told me. Sometimes you get lost in delusion. Oh, there's a door. <laughs> Love that for me. Okay. We are back at the fish thingy. Ooh, I'm sorry. I'm getting a bit. I'm sorry. Also, can I ask if everything is Began like. Began to forget the world we know. Can I ask if everything is okay? Like, can you see you? Is it glitchy? Because I'm scared it's very glitchy, but like I can't really see much. I think it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. Sorry, but this needs to be a bit faster. Oh he God! Began to despise this is the man with a royal contempt. Not doing okay. 
Oh, poor boy. Oh, my dear. Oh, dear. You, you little angel, I'm sorry. Also, ew. What the fuck is going on here? This is disgusting. This is disgusting, okay? Well, let's go up here. What's going on here? We got anything to interact with? I do interact with things. Can I? Bro, I want to interact with you. Can I interact with you? We really can't, right? We really can interact with you, right? Yeah. yeah. They think I can. I'm trying to understand where I can go, what I can do. Because it seems like we can't do much, right? Okay, where are we? Oh, he's here, and I get that. Okay. I got it. Do I have to go somewhere like here? Can't really do much here. I'll just go here and then just like maybe. Okay. Sir? Sir? I'm sorry, wait, wait. Is that the shape Willa Wonka? <laughs> what the fuck is the, the sh our like? What's going on? Okay, let's explore then. We don't have much to explore, but I'm I don't know where I'm supposed to go. To be honest, there ain't much I can do. Right now, a dot there, but that's the light. I feel so dumb right now. Can someone please tell me what I'm supposed? To oh God, I feel such an like such an idiot. Okay, we have. Let's go back. Let's go back here. Maybe we're not supposed to already get here. We need to check something out there, maybe. Well, we are slow as shit. Can we, like, go a bit faster, please? I have places to go in. Like, I don't know. The end of the game. I don't know if there's something we need to pick up here. Did I miss something here? They, there, there is nothing, right? I came here, like, for absolutely no reason, right? Yep. Wow. Oh, there is something here. Hi. Drugs. That's what we have here. I don't blame it. I would like to be high as a fucking kite. To be to be doing a job like this, I'll be honest. The shit seems boring. Smells bad. Like no. This is terrible. Wow, I am a shiny entity. <gasps> oh no, are we the prince? Oh god, yes, yes. Oh yes, boy. Look at us. I think we are actually the prince. We are. Oh, I can. No, I can't. I can't interact with him. My dude. I'll just stay here and look at him for a while. Can I? Uh, okay, the light is up there, and we either go up here and then go up here. Can I, I still thought I could <gasps> save? Oh, yes. Well, I'm so dumb. Even after he said he was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. Oh no. The palace would be packed with his companions. Oh no! Don't tell me he got in the like fish thingy machine. Oh no. Also I can't move any 
faster than this. Including the wise Calico who'd insisted on advising. Oh god. Sorry, loud as shit. I'm sorry. It's loud as shit again. I don't want to make myself too loud, but also I think I'll have to be quite loud. Okay. Let go. We're back. Yep. Let go. I think he got into the machine and he died. He got turned into Canada Sam. The music is still so loud. Absolutely not. This is too loud. Again, it's still too loud. I'll, I'll like I'll lower it again a little bit later. For now, I'll try my best. His prince waiting, holding his crown. Holding his crown. Where's our prince? There was only one thing left to do. Married this baby. Bend down his head. Oh no, he chopped his head off. Oh no, he chopped his head off. He chopped his uh, his own head off. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. Rest, I think you know. Mrs. Finch, your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. You oh 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 no. Oh god. Oh for fuck's sake. Jesus Christ, this fucking game. My brother was really cool. I wish you could have met him. Oh wait. Are, are we are we basically all done? Oh god, we are almost done. JK. Thought we were like a lot like in a worse position than this. Oh god. Is it now too low? I hope it's not. Let's get out of here. Where? Okay, let's. I think. No, no, I don't want to go in. No, no, I don't want to go in. I accidentally went back in. I'm sorry. How do we get up? No, I don't want to go in. Stop it. Listen, bitch, I don't want to fight you, but you're making it hard for me to not hit you. Can you, like, go down? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Yay. Okay. We're, we're doing well. I think. I think. We are almost at the top. Where am I? I am lost. Okay. Okay, we're in nowhere. Oh no, is it broken? Yes it is, right? Oh, okay. How are we getting up there? Okay, we are not going up the stair, I can't imagine, right? Then how are we getting up? Can we like in any way to jump here? Fuck. Hmm. Still like I don't think we have anything else down here that could help us. Because that just brings us to the boat. And here we kind of just go back, I think. No, here we just go back. Let me pl plan this out a bit. Oh god, how are we getting there? Is there a way there to, for us to climb over there? I don't think. I think we have to go this way. 
I just need to understand how. Okay, I'll, I'll actually let's go back to this side. Uh, let's see if I can figure it out from here. Listen, Jesus fucking Christ. You absolutely hateful. Okay, maybe... Maybe from this side? Is there a way we can climb here? Is there like a way we can... Climb up? Well, my eyes are not doing well. I'll say that much. Yep, yeah, no. There is no way you're gonna do this. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. So, we cannot go up this way, we have to go up that way. But the stairs are broken, so how the crap am I getting up there? Okay cat, okay, you can figure this out, you can figure this out. Right? Right? You can't, right? Right? Okay, no. Okay, maybe... Can we, like, climb in any way? Is there a way for us to climb it? Ew! I supposed to go up? How? I'll just go back. Maybe I missed like something, a way to go up. It could be, yeah. It could be. I'm bad at things sometimes. Actually, you know what? Most times. Let's go in. Maybe there are some stairs or something? The stairs are here. I'm sorry. I am just fully just an idiot. I'm sorry. Like I'm staring at you. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Uh, no, got distracted. Oh, we're supposed to pull it this way. Let's go. On the way back from Lewis's funeral, my mom told me to start packing. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. That does make sense, though. I'm not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. Oh, no. This game is sad. I wish we'd stayed. No, dude. Don't know if I would have stayed. Trauma is still trauma. But I understand why we left. And I feel like your mother just didn't want to be more traumatized than she already was. What happened that night had been coming for a long time. back at eat it I, mean, I think we're back at how we eat it that now but it had to end one way or another oh, no. 
Oh god, this is so pretty. to tell you about that last night. Oh no. Eat it. Don't tell me if you die. I'm so, I feel so bad. <gasps> we are fighting. Oh no. This bitch. That whole last day. Edie just watched his pack and didn't say a word. Mm -hmm. Poor Edie. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, To our final night together, and all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Edith, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. Oh, Why don't no. you go open it? Did she The grown-ups have to argue now. I'm sorry, you're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just enjoy our last. I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. Oh no. Please be nice to the old. Please be nice to the old lady, please. The power had been shut off that morning, but Edie yeah. always had plenty of candles. When my mom said the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance or that Edie had a key to it. Wow, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why do you have candles right next to books? You want the house to burn down then? Hmm? The thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your stories. I think it's best. If Edith and I leave tonight. Oh no, poor woman. We'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning. Okay. Oh no, not me. What? Oh. Edith. Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you. Oh. But there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were oh. born. This is cute. That night, the tide way way out it was the first and last time i ever saw the old house aground Aww. there'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean they oh. called it the lowest tide in a thousand years okay. uh, i need to also look God, around it smelled awful you no. what that fish is that house Every day of my life. We're going this way. But well, I that. never thought I'd go back to it. <gasps> she went back? Oh no. When the fog rolled in, I lost my way. Oh no. Granny. I got turned around. I started seeing things. Oh god. What? Lovely. This is awful. This is a, a, an actual nightmare. Things I'd forgotten had ever existed. Oh god, I did not see the writing. Oh yes, we are here. But when I saw of things came back to me. Or maybe I came back to them. Mm. Ma'am. This is kind of sad. Okay, I've been too things quiet. I can't explain, but that I need you to try and... Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine. Edith! Mom, you're gonna rip it! Let go! I kicked and screamed, but... Mom dragged me to the car. Oh, no. That's actually... 
actually kind of sad. I'm sorry. I never saw Great Grandma Edie again. No, Edie. Oh God. The next morning, the band came to pick her up, but she was already gone. Yeah, I kind of imagined it. She went back to the house. Right? After that, we moved around a lot. We both tried to make the best of it. Ooh. A few years went by. Mm. My mom doesn't like to talk about it. Oh. God. But she started getting sick a lot. Oh, oh no, her mom died the rest she got sick. Quickly. Oh god. She got better for a while. And then she did. Yo yo. My mouse bed is tiny as shit. And then I was alone. Last bench left alive. It's so isolating. Oh, poor girl. Well, I found out about you. Hmm. I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. If we lived forever, maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. What is This journal was supposed to be for you. But now what I hope is... you'll never see it. What is that? I just want to meet you. And tell you all these stories myself. Mm. But I guess if you're reading this now, things didn't work out that way. Oh no, don't tell me she also died. Jesus Christ. This is where your story begins. Oh. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good oh, luck. Jesus Christ. Also, look at this thing. Oh god, it's so pretty. Oh god, it's so pretty. <sighs> By Giant Sparrow. Yeah, it's a Giant Sparrow story. She looked at us. 48 to 13. Oh, it's a dedicated story to someone. That's so nice. Oh god, that's so nice. Okay, we. Okay, I'll still keep this going. Actually, wait a second. I'll lower it a bit so you can hear me speak while this still plays in the background. First of all, this game was great. I love this game. Did it go on for a bit to more than I thought, to be honest? I was down 15, actually. It was basically as long as I imagined it. So I think we are absolutely fine. Also, they did put every single one as a child picture. Almost. Not the engineer <laughs> yet. But like, so as I said, this game, I knew it was was very good. This game was it's fear it's amazing. So I think a couple of parts fell a bit slow, but I think mostly it's because of my PC. I think that if you have a better CPU and graphics, you're not gonna have as many issues. 
Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Let me go back to here. Let me go back to here so you can see me. My god, my eyes are melting. Okay, now you should at least have a bit less. There should be a bit less issues with connection, but... First of all, thank you to the people who sticked this whole time and stayed here. Because I see that there is someone here. And... Um, I hope you've liked this game as much as I did. I'm like I'm glad that we finished at a timely manner. See, see, last time we finished at midnight. Okay, we used to finish at midnight, so I think it's like a bit nicer if we start a bit earlier. Maybe eight is a bit better than seven, but uh, I'll figure this out. Most because eight is a bit of an in between. This game was very fun. Sorry if I got quite quiet towards the end but I thought the story needed to shine a bit more by itself without me speaking too much on top of it and it is quite an emotional game and as someone who lost family members quite close I have lost my dad uh, in I have lost my dad so it's kind of like very a kind of a therapeutic like therapeutic game to play and it feels very very like meaningful as a game i'm gonna check now when this game was created just super quickly just to make sure that because i know it's not a new game i just do not know how old like how new it is so Also, <laughs> Jesus Christ, um, I the, the thing that struck that I got stuck the most, yeah, it's a 2018. I was right then. <laughs> I remember correctly. It's a 2018 movie, but like this game was perfect. I think. I think outside of me not understanding how the part where Lewis, her brother. Um, how that worked because you have to use the keyboards to move the character in his brain and with the mouse you still had to keep up with the fishes which kind of messed me up a bit because of course I, my keyboard it's not like I don't have my arrow, arrows here I had them here so I was in this position trying to do everything which not nice remind you to have a better positioning with your keyboard but I have my plate and I was happy to also eat with you, even though at a certain point I was just like starving, so I just stuffed my face with food while playing. But yes, this game, I think maybe not a 10 out of 10 completely, but I would give it like a like 9. Because personally, the story was great. The story was absolutely amazing, in my opinion, because it's very well built. And even though we're talking about death and and tragedy, the way it was like structured, it's very, very, very like enticing. And I think the fact that even though everything is quite bleak, so raise the brightness of your screens. Don't be like me. I have it at seventy percent, and still it was a bit too dark. Also, I do have quite, like, I have pretty bad, like, sight issues. So, it could be probably connected to that. But, I do feel like it's, it was very well structured. Was it paced perfectly? I, certain parts felt very slow, where even though you tried to go as, to walk, like, as fast as you could, it was still quite slow. So, those those parts maybe was uh, were a bit more tricky like for example the as i said the lewis part but also the lewis part was probably like the most <laughs> hard hitting even though very very young kids died i felt like that one was the 
most difficult because it was mostly connected with people losing touch with re reality, the de realization, and just going completely manic, which does like it's very very sad because someone dying because of the de realization that they have without like without even knowing about it. So that was probably like the heaviest part, and also gonna be honest the imagery the last piece she was just getting she was just like the kid was just getting out of her vagina she was just giving birth so we had a perspective of a kid like getting birth coming out which is a little bit weird also that i did not know i was quite i've been quite lucky that i've never been spoiled this game because most people actually are ve were very good. The people that played this game, I haven't heard anyone talk about the ending outside of a review or like outside of without a disclaimer about the ending of this game. So I'm quite happy about it because I did not know that um, Edith died, and I did not know that this was written for her like child. So it's quite, that's quite moving. Um, I'm quite happy to have played it. I think, yeah, I just think it was a great experience to be honest. I'm sorry if I haven't put any music behind this last part, but to be honest, having to turn on music again, I didn't feel like it. Also, I didn't, as usual, like I wanted to have breaks in between the game, but I think that playing it through like, I did and just having small pauses while playing the game was probably the best part. Also, uh, I'm sorry if I was I was get going out of my mind because of the which part was it because of the assassination thing, the cartoon part of it. Uh, not the cartoon, the comic part of it, but unfortunately I'm a very anxious I'm a very anxious person. And as I said, I tend to get really into the things that I'm playing, reading, watching. And that sometimes means that I, even like the music, getting uh, a bit more, you know, that kind of music that is supposed to give you a bit of, you know, something is going to happen, a bit more anxious, gives me a, a mild anxiety. And I feel it, like I tense up and I start, I feel the anxiety coming in. So that's why I was a bit, I took off my headphones, so you're never gonna see me play like very scary games because I'm gonna have anxiety and this bitch is not gonna sleep at all. But yes, outside of me <laughs> rambling <laughs> for way too long, uh, I hope you enjoyed. I'm gonna see you actually for a little bit and let's see actually how long we did it. Yeah, we did it about over a bit over three hours, which was mostly because I am incompetent and because of like my poor sight at times, even things that are supposed like are supposed to be very clear where I'm supposed to go, it makes it a bit harder. And I think the fact that everything was so dark and my brightness wasn't as bright made it much more difficult. Maybe next time I'll just turn off my spotlight over there. But the thing is, the without the light, it would be a bit easier to see. But also, you you wouldn't see me at all, which it's probably fine. But like maybe I need to find a new strategy for lighting because that just back backlights my a complete corner of my room and all behind the my monitor. So it makes it probably much harder to see anything on the monitor. Oh, bye. Oh god, I didn't even see. Sorry, I didn't see you. You, you like broke anything. Oh god, I I didn't see the last two messages because they they weren't. The chat was on pause for me. Oh god, I'm so sad. I'm sorry you didn't say bye to Nick. Like he's an old friend of mine. We met online because we liked us uh, the same band. But I think we like met when I was 15, so we knew each other for a long time. We've known each other for a long time. But yeah. 
Whew, after all this, let me just close a bunch of things. Okay. I want to thank you again for being here. And um, yeah, as I said, I actually, I don't think I finished saying that the graphics were great and I love them. So they made the sad part of the game bit better I'll be honest they made it better because I got distracted because I see pretty thing and I'm like oh pretty oh wait we're talking about people dying I'm sorry yeah right <laughs> okay I need to stop wrangling let's say goodbye to the golden child over there which is he's sleeping I'm not gonna go bother him also I need to turn off those candles because they are about to finish and I don't want to buy new candles <laughs> Jesus Christ okay I don't got no candle budget right now. <laughs> okay, so I'll see you on Tuesday. And I'll say this here simply more of a reminder for myself, but every time I play a I stream a playthrough, I upload the next Saturday of the Saturday of the week, basically after the stream, I upload the VOD on my YouTube and I publish it there. I just publish it on sat on Saturday simply because of scheduling and because I have to keep up with the other VODs, the three other VODs of the week. So I think uploading it on Saturday is just the best option for me right now when it comes to scheduling. So even if you're not here, or if you see this on YouTube, you know that once it's published, uh, you can always see the games basically uploaded like it did with the last two ones, Grimm's Hollow as well as F Found, which was also an Annapurna uh, pr like produced game. I'll see if we have other cool Annapurna games we can play. But for now, bye. See you on Tuesday, Wednesday or Thursday for our co-working session as usual, or see you in two weeks on Saturday for another gameplay. Bye! Let me just do some ASMR. I don't know why this has become like the most relaxing thing ever. Okay, bye, 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 bye.